Hello YouTube, I'm gonna show you Let's see this is a HP two thousand and it has Windows eight on it and uh I'm gonna show you guys how to make it boot or install a different system like Windows 7 if you don't like Windows 8 so first of all you start it and press escape a few times and it's gonna show this menu right here I don't know if you guys can see it F1 system info Blah blah blah. Well, if you guys can see that right there. So, pretty much, you hit F10 to go to BIOS setup. And it doesn't look that good. So on the top, we got main security system configuration. We got a system configuration. Sorry about that. You go to boot options right here. I don't know if you can read that. Boot options. Then you go down where it says legacy support. Legacy support is what does the UEFI boot which means that it's just protected so it's just gonna boot into Windows 8 and it's not gonna let you boot through anything so we just enable right here on legacy we enable it then you come here in the bottom and where it says legacy boot order so technically you're just gonna select what you want the first the first boot to be on which for now I'm going to reinstall Windows 8 so this is a Windows 8 DVD um, this is a backup of mine Let's see My Windows 8 So it's just a backup. Not this is the original. Okay. So I'm just showing this for for you guys to know how to be able to like install Linux or some other operating system. If you got an original copy of Windows 7 or whatever else you guys want to install. So just make sure for now, uh, I'm going to install it through the DVD drive. So select uh, internal CD DVD ROM drive. So you guys hit F10, it's gonna save it. Once you're done with that, hit escape again. So you guys go to the boot menu. Escape. Okay, so right now, right here, we're gonna go to boot device options, which is F9. And now you're gonna have more options. Before it was only OS, boot manager, and boot from EFI file. Which now we're gonna go to internal CD DVD ROM drive, hit enter. And We are on the installation screen. I'm just doing this for educational purposes. So, just to show you guys, it is the installation screen, it's not the boot screen.
this camera no more. Focus. There it is, kind of focus. Sorry for that. There it goes. It's gonna start. And there we go. See? That's the easiest way to do it. You guys please just see you hit next and install windows so you can also select repair windows or repair your computer so that's pretty much it thank you for watching